Hey guys, I'm Brandy. Welcome to Brandy and Company. So in today's video, it's a vlog, um, and I'm going to meet one of my best friends, Bonita. So I'm just going to show you what my day was like that day. Yeah. It's my friend Benita. <laughs> Don't forget to follow her on Please. YouTube. What's your channel? It's my name, Benita.Brewington. And same thing on Instagram. Yay. Hey guys. Look how chic Benita looks this morning. We're having a little breakfast cheeky date. Yeah, a little, a little a business lunch. I mean, the business. business. Oh my God. I love this. You guys, this color goes with everything. You look great. She has her orange on. I didn't know you had black ones. Love, love, love. Um, so cute. Today I'm wearing my new Toolbox 26 from Hermes. My favorite New Balance 327. So what bag are you looking at right now? I definitely want to get uh, the Kelly. Yeah. Um, either I, I would do a 32. I would. I would do a 32. Okay. Relax. 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 Like Togo leather. Yeah, for, definitely. For sure. What about color? Um, something dark. Really? Something dark. Um, like yeah. what color fan? See, I'm not. I'm, I'm okay as long as it's a neutral, darker color. What about Eco? Yeah, that would be good too. But that's the lightest I would get. Okay. Bonita, which was super awesome. And so now I'm on my way to pick up little Jackson. You guys, Jackson is doing amazing. A uh, little quick update on his potty training. The last time you guys saw me vlog, we were talking about luxury mistakes. And I mentioned we were getting ready to start potty training him. Well, it's been three weeks and he's finally like really getting it. Like he will say he needs to go to the potty and I'm so proud of him. And seeing his confidence is just everything to me. Um, so we're on the way to pick him up. We mean it, you guys watching and me <laughs> to pick him up. We'll see how his little day at school went and I'll check back in with you guys shortly. So I listen to podcasts driving right now I'm listening to reality with the king um, with Carlos King I love listening to he and Dr. Heavenly but I do not listen to this when I'm in the car with Jackson all right so we got Jackson he's eating his snacks we're gonna go home he said he'd like mac and cheese for lunch we're gonna get him some mac and cheese and I'm eating leftover sushi that my husband and I grabbed from Wegmans. I don't know if you guys have a Wegmans near you, but some of the store-bought sushi is really, really good. We got a platter for like $26. It's really good. We had so much left over. So I'm gonna have that for lunch. It's so like rainy outside, so my hair is reflecting that. Um, all right, so I used to wear a like a tennis bracelet on this wrist with my watch and it broke. And so I considered investing in a, a real one. That one was not real. And I went to a jeweler and I just decided, you know what? My fake one lasted me over four years. I don't know if I want to invest like five plus thousand dollars in one. Um, let's just get another one for less than $200. So. I'm bringing that up because it arrived today. I decided to go with Nordstrom this go round. If I don't like this one, there's one at Ross and, Ross and Simons, Ross and Simmons that I'm gonna try out. So I thought I'd open this with you all. All right. I'll have this linked below. Let's give it open. This is the brand. Chrysalis. 
So a lot of places have um, some that are not real, but they're like overlay, like palladium overlay or white gold overlay. I specifically want sterling silver so that I can keep it on 24 seven. My other one, the only time I took it off is if I was going in chlorine, so at the pool, um, because it will tarnish it if you put sterling silver in chlorine. So I even take my Tiffany one off. It's the only other silver piece I really wear. This doesn't look bad, huh? feel like it'll be secure. So um, if you are in the market for one of these or after this video decide you're in the market, just know sterling is gonna be a little more expensive than these plated items, but that's because they're just gonna last longer. Like you're not gonna to have to worry about it turning. And the one that I had that broke, it was gonna cost $200 to repair it. Not worth that to me. At that point, just get a new one. So I've kind of put in my mind that every five years I might be buying a new one, but it will probably never amount to the price of a real one. So I really, really like this. It, and it has a very good weight to it. Okay, we're going to have lunch. Jackson's having mac and cheese. I'm having the leftover sushi, which I told you guys about. Like I said, I'm having the leftover Wegman sushi. I love ponzi sauce. Have any of you out there ever used this or chosen to use this over like soy sauce? It's to me less salty. It has a hint of citrus. It's just absolutely delicious. So I prefer to eat my sushi with this. And Jackson's having his mac and cheese with a pancake. So we're in Jackson's room. He's about to go down for a nap. And I tell you, I'm just loving being a stay-at-home mom. I just thank God I have the opportunity to put him down for a nap every day. It's like such a blessing. Just love me, this I know. 